Hey guys, Brock Bowman here uh, with Bowman GT. Just um, making a video about something I should have known already. So, I don't know if you guys know, but I have a Can-Am Maverick X3. It's 2019. It looks like it's about 10 years old already because of the dust and dirt from all the trips we've taken in it so far. Anyway, I bought the base model because I planned on tuning it and doing a bunch of upgrades anyway. Um, I go through the whole thing when it's all cleaned up and put back together. But this video is just to show you guys thinking about tuning it, where to find this really, really easy to find plug. But if you don't know where it is, you don't know where it is. <laughs> so I'm going to make this video here, show you how to get to it. Oh, pull that off. And it's normally plugged right in there. Okay, it looks like this. Plugged in there into a dummy slot just to keep the dirt out, okay? So I loosened it up and I forced it back in through here and under. Now obviously you're gonna have to take your glove box off if you wanna do this mod like this. Um, and you're probably gonna wanna take your glove box off anyway because you probably wanna change your fuel pump if you have anything older than an 18. Uh, 172 horse, you'll need to change that fuel pump to do a tune. But I tucked it under here and plugged the adapter from Vivid Racing VR Tune. Um, there you have it. So when I put it back together after the pump's done, it will stick inside the glove box uh, for easy access. That's it. That's where the plug is, guys, for your Maverick X3. Let me know if you have any questions. Bye.